So how do you go about choosing a hiking trail? The first thing that you want to consider is your physical ability. How much can you handle? Are your knees strong enough to handle long distance walking? Do you experience shortness of breath when you do certain activities? Do you stay reasonably active and exercise on a regular basis? It's good to take on a challenge, but it's also important to make sure that it's within your capability and within what your body can handle. And this is going to help you have a general idea about whether you want to go with an easy trail a moderate trail or a hard one and from here you should be able to pick a location are you planning on hiking in your state or outside of your state is it going to be a national park a state park is it going to be a national forest or a designated wilderness area most of outdoor stores like REI or even visitor centers in national parks provide or have maps that are available for purchase and these maps contain information about different hiking trails in the area information like the length of the trail the expected duration to complete it what wildlife can you expect on the trail and general expectations but if you're not able to have a physical map you can always use the internet beforehand to research download the map or two to your phone and use it from there or you can also rely on some of the hiking and backpacking mobile applications. And one of our favorites is All Trails. And All Trails is a hiking and backpacking application with a lot of information about hiking trails all over the world. And the application provides information about the trail profile, the distance, the difficulty, weather conditions, what to expect on the trail, photos, as well as reviews from a large community of hikers and backpackers. And if you want to learn more about how how to use the app both for the free version and the pro version you can check this video up here and all trails came up with a new explore interface that can help you find specific trails that matches what you are looking for and they introduce new groupings such as top trails nearby best views nearby trails less traveled you can also browse by activity are you looking for trails for hiking mountain biking running or backpacking there are also groups like top moderate trails nearby weekend walk dog friendly trails best waterfalls or best lakes nearby and this feature that they just introduced will help you to filter down and find things that matches what you are looking for and what experiences you are trying to have and once you know which trail that you are interested in you want to make sure that you do have a physical map just like we mentioned earlier or you can download a map to your phone which by the way this application allows you to download an offline map to your phone that you can rely on once you get to the trail now on top of making sure that you are prepared in terms of gear and skill set there are a couple of additional things that you want to keep in mind and take into consideration and the first one are you hiking alone or you are hiking with someone else and if you are hiking alone you want to make sure that you are letting someone know where you are going whether it's a friend or a family member you want to communicate the start time or the expected end time of your hike and if you are hiking with someone else you also want to make sure that this trail is within their capability you want to make sure that you are communicating your expectations beforehand are you doing this hike or this trail for photography videography do you want to challenge yourself and finish it within a specific time frame communicating these things is going to be helpful for you and for the person that you are hiking with and the second thing that you want to consider is the time to get to the trailhead this is something very important that you need to budget for just to make sure how much time you are going to be spending outside of being on the trail some trail are further than the others and you always help to have a solid plan beforehand and this is pretty much it for how to choose a hiking trail i hope that you guys found this video useful and if you did give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing to our channel your trekking pals habiba and alex and we'll see you soon on a new adventure